The sun is rising here in Qatar. Hey everyone, it's Khalifa Al Haroun, also known as Mr. Q. It's a lovely day and we're gonna go discover some pretty amazing places. So, expect to defy ordinary with Nissan. Before we start our journey, let's just connect and we're done. First stop is Sug Wagif, the standing market. The oldest market here in Qatar. And I love it because you get to see people walking around, just having a chill time. And just next door, we've got Msherab. This is where you've got all of the new stuff. It's a sustainable city that's uh, pretty amazing. So let's check it out. One of the reasons why I love coming here is because there are a lot of cool restaurants, cafes, the Qatari architecture. So next up, we're gonna be heading over to West Bay. Tall, beautiful skyscrapers like you've never seen before. Blue skies and green sea, you're gonna like it. Take a look at these amazing towers just jutting out into the sky. Listen, I'm going from one place to the other and I need a car that is just gonna help me enjoy the view and get me there safely. Plus, I've got power. This is Katara, and to show it all off, I've got the perfect view. It's on the hills. All right, guys, is this the best view ever or what? Yes, you get to see a giant falcon's hat. You've got that big toy box, that's a toy shop. We've got Shakespeare Street, Tasty Street, beautiful amphitheater, but most important of all, you get to breathe the fresh air. And right behind those giant steps is our next destination. It's called the Pearl. And now we're here in the Pearl Island, designed to look like a string of pearls. But why? Well, Qatar was known as a pearl diving country. That's how uh, we sustained ourselves. Today, this island is a place that a lot of people aspire to live in because you've got opulent properties and amazing restaurants, and you just get to enjoy the ambiance. Just like I am enjoying the ambiance and the luxury in this patrol. This is Lucille Boulevard. A lot of festivals happen here. This is Lucille Stadium, the biggest stadium here in Qatar. All right, now from the city to the desert. From skyscrapers to sand dunes. And I'm telling you, when I'm in the patrol, I have no worries. Whether I'm on the sand, on a dune, or heading to the inland sea, I know I'm gonna get there without a problem. And the only thing left for me to do is just enjoy this little oasis that I set up here in the desert, smelling the sea breeze, enjoying the sunset, and of course, with my trusty companion, 